after this video that you'll see on the side of the screen a lot of people did ask me what would be the reason that you would want to bypass or delete this little filter of the map sensor on your toyota kd engine now uh, there's two questions that came up a lot now the first question was what went wrong with the filter why would you want to delete it now the first thing that i'm going to show you is this is not a broken one i don't have a broken one on hand right now but i can show you where the problem often lays now on the filter on the side here there's often a crack that appears somewhere on the top side a very fine crack if it's clean if it's dirty you won't be able to see it so you might have to wipe it off in order to see the crack but that is often where the problem lies now the reason why this crack is most probably because um, this filter is subject to a lot of heat on top of the engine and except for the heat there's also the air coming in from the top through the hood scoop on the three liter one um, which is a top mount cooler so this one is subject to a lot of heat and then to a lot of cool air coming in on top and then also subject to some water should it be raining that water is also tapping on it so it's hot and cold hot and cold and that's often why they crack so the crack does often uh, occur on the top side like i showed you right about there somewhere that's usually where the crack is now except for that sometimes even at the bottom there's a crack that you'll see less likely um, in the bottom part like so in this case the entire little nozzle on the bottom side the one that's fixed you can still see it attached the entire nozzle one broke off because it was cracked and then it caught onto something and it broke off so that is the reason why these things are often deleted now uh, you don't have to permanently delete it this can only be a temporary fix as well if you don't want to leave it off um, it's personal choice obviously now how long you take to replace it is entirely up to you I have left mine off and it's been for oof, it's a it's a lot of kilometers and it's been for more than four years that I left it off and still no issues um, the main purpose of this is to stop oil from entering the map center now uh, it's very little oil if your uh, engine does not have too much blow by and so on the chances of oil in the map sensor are much slimmer so once again it's your own choice second question that i got asked a lot is what are the symptoms of these things being cracked or clogged they can also be clogged even if you don't see a crack there can be something stuck inside now the common symptom for these being cracked or clogged would be a loss of power in your engine in other words the engine would not boost as normal because the map center would not be reading the correct pressure and therefore it cannot allocate the amount of, right amount of fuel with the allocated amount of pressure that it's supposed to be getting so you will feel a, an adequate loss of power and often there would be a check engine light that comes up and comes up on your dashboard as well so these are the two most common reasons why you would want to delete this whether it's permanent or just temporary entirely up to you but that would be the symptoms and that would be the reason to delete, it, uh, to delete it and also where to look for the problem. It could be a crack on top or a crack on the bottom. So if you think this is very useful, be sure to like this video and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so yet. Until next time, thank you very much guys.